My name is Nikki. I'm an English makeup artist and I live with Carlo and our daughter Skye in Positano, Italy. Our house is far from the road but surrounded by fruit trees and olive groves and we grow our own food. We'll show you what it's really like to live on the Amalfi Coast. Subscribe and welcome to the Positano Diaries. I decided I would bring Holly down for a quick walk on the beach at Arienza today. The last time I walked down here was on New Year's Day and that was in the very first Positano Diaries where I tried to take a swim and failed miserably because I got cramp in both my legs because it was too cold. Anyhow, I'm not going to swim today, I'm just going to have a little walk with Holly and then I will be doing a bit of shopping and popping back home. That's about it. Interesting. Come to the cemetery to meet Carla for lunch today because we haven't had lunch together for quite a long time because he hasn't had a day off uh, for about 10 days. So hey. is... Hello. Hello. It's the first day with the lunch break so we're going to have some lunch and go out for a walk around the back of the cemetery. Okay. We are off exploring we're behind the cemetery. It's a little area where Carla used to play when he was a little boy. 
absolutely stunning lighting at the moment. Uh, there's a little cave down there. Yeah, there's this tiny little cave here and it looks like somebody's been sleeping in it. There's a duvet in there. Carly used to play in there when he was little with his brothers. He used to camp out. Now, if I can just get into the right position, I think this would make a great Instagram photo. <laughs> C'è una posizione che non so come la posso definire da qua. Non è molto elegante. Scusa, ma tu mi fai... Basta solo che non cadi, poi... Chi ci vuole alzarsi in piedi là? Ok. Sì, sì, puoi andare in piedi da così. Basta che ti alzi, no? No! Ti stai spaventando da solo, ce la fai benissimo alzarti là. Ma non so dove devo i piedi, non volevo andare qui sopra. Alzati prima e poi decidi dove li devi mettere. No. Vuoi che vengo lì? Ti faccio vedere come si fa, poi torni indietro. Okay. I'm worried, my man. Okay. Sembra che stiamo avventurando nella giungla, no? We have arrived in an olive grove. Slightly abandoned olive grove. We haven't put the nets out, even though it's olive picking harvest time. Beautiful wonky old carob tree there. We have found an abandoned property. This is a water deposit. Carly used to come here. Here dentro c'è un grande buco che va tipo 30 metri dentro la roccia. 30 metri? 30 metri, sì. Ed è largo quanto questo edificio qua che si vede. E va 30 metri dentro. Wow. Ed è tutto pieno d'acqua. It's part of the town's water reservoir. Interesting. E tu una volta venivi qua la mattina per fare cosa? A clorare l'acqua, a mettere il cloro nell'acqua. He used to come and chlorinate the water every morning. It was part of his extra cemeterial duties. Se vedi questo tubo qua? Yeah. Fai vedere questo tubo. Questo tubo uh, l'hanno messo negli anni Ottanta quando c'è stata una grande carenza d'acqua a Positano e veniva una nave e pompavano sull'acqua qua dentro. Ah. Cioè, quindi questo tubo non faceva scendere l'acqua, la, la, la faceva salire e poi riscendeva di qua perché la... Allora, questo è collegato con la cascata sulla spiaggia della, la spiaggia della porta? Esattamente. Ah! Che bello qua! That is something that I have never noticed before. Amazing! This waterfall is the excess water that is not being used and consumed in Positano. We're going this way down. 
because it's pretty down here and I can see from here that the sky is doing this whole pink and orange thing. This bit is it. Could you not go there, please? Stop it! Che questa è la vista? Da qui? Guarda che carino. Smetti di tenermi la maglia, per favore. Not that that would help much if he did fall. <laughs> At the end of each month, I do a question and answers video over on my Patreon account. And um, I had quite a lot of questions this month, so I thought I'd put some of them in here and the rest of them will be over there. So if you want to join up, you can, um, but I'm going to put some of the questions here because there were some fun ones. Is it possible to live in Positano without your own transport? È possibile vivere a Positano senza trasporto? Assolutamente. Certo. certo of course. Sì. Carlo's parents don't have any form of transport anymore. Um, there is a local bus that does the loop around Positano every half hour um, and there's a bus that goes up to Monte Petuso pretty much every hour, sometimes every two hours, but it's also fairly easy to walk around as well. So it's very easy to live here and of course we're connected to Sorrento and Amalfi and all the other towns by more buses and ferries as well. So you can easily live here without transport. Ok, per fare una risposta più condensata è che se stai bene e ce la fai a camminare tutte queste scale, no problem. Yeah. Ok, here's one. Um, I'm aware that most restaurants close in the off season, but are restaurants like Da Vincenzo Mediterraneo and Casa Bottega open? Oh. No! No. <laughs> no. When we say that everything is shut in the winter, we mean everything is shut in the winter. They have made it a rule that one restaurant in town has to stay open and one bar has to stay open. If others want to stay open, they will, but there has to be one open and there usually is one or perhaps two. Do gelato shops stay open? I negozi di gelati rimangono aperti. No. In inverno non è molto richiesto il gelato. The only things that are open in the winter are the food stores, the delicatessen, the fruit and vegetable shop, the pescheria, the fish shop, and the butchers. That is it. Adesso capisco perché ti sei seduta là. Così sei più in alto di me e quando io provo a parlare tu vai sì, davanti. Sì, dai, parla di gelato. No, il gelato niente. Non è richiesto in inverno? No, non perché? si mangia. Perché è freddo e il gelato è freddo e non va bene. <laughs> Sì, l'ho anche ripreso. Era forse, eh? Eh. Not sure if you heard that, but that was dynamite being exploded where they are digging an elevator to the cemetery. It's been going on all day. This is where they are excavating. I'm blowing up dynamite. It's been going on for months, all summer. Just to give you an idea of where we are. A Londra qui, c'è là. La spesa del panorama. A Londra la fanno qua. Devi pagare il doppio, mo, questa spesa che fai. Con il panorama che abbiamo qua. Stop to pick up some fruit. See, I'm pretty banana, see. The Christmas Pandoras are hung up in the shop already. It's the 5th of November. This is where we come to do most of our shopping. Time to go home.
gonna try a big small and then they all fell on the roof. Wow. <laughs> Thank you.